Hello YouTube, welcome back to another tutorial, and this one I'm going to teach you how to get the best quality videos for YouTube. This is, this is not like an HD tutorial, this is a tutorial on how to get the best quality out of things that you have recorded. Okay? First thing you want to do, you want to go to, well you could do this basically with any video editor, just to let you know. You want to go to your, where you have your video saved. You want to click on the videos, and what you want to pay attention to is the frame width and then the frame height. That is the maximum resolution that your video can do. If you put it any higher, it'll stretch the video out and it'll actually become less quality or less better quality. And that's what happens when people like convert this to HD. When it's not recorded in HD, it just makes the quality worse, and it just makes the file size a lot bigger. So I'm going to put this into Sony Vegas. I'm just going to, for some reason, it, there we go. And you want to go to File, go to Properties, and what you want to do is you want to set the width and height to the same size that is set on the folder. So I'm going to go to 720 by 480 and you can't go any higher because the quality would not improve it would actually get worse just to let you know in frame rate you put it on how you recorded it so I put it on uh, 60 frames per second because that's what my camera records at if it records at 30 frames per second leave it at 30 frames per second it will not get any more smooth if you put it at uh, 60 frames per second your pix your pixel aspect ratio if it's full screen you want it to be this setting right here but if it's widescreen you want it to be this setting and do not convert it to widescreen if it's not already widescreen otherwise it will stretch out the image and it will look pretty bad pixel format I usually have mine a 32 bit video levels I either have it this or 8-bit. I'll have it 8-bit this time. It's faster rendering. And there we go. I already have this setting saved as video camera. I also have one as Minecraft. I'm just going to hit apply. Hit OK. And you notice if I click stretch, nothing. See? OK. So now what you want to do is you want to render it. So go file. Render as and you could use any format that you like uh... main concept mpeg2 saves it the fastest in my opinion so you want to go to custom you want to enter your width and your height right here leave the iframes and b frames the same frame rate i always have it at thirty frames per second because that's how I'll watch youtube handles Aspect ratio, if it's in widescreen, put it to 16 by 9. If it's full screen, put it to 4 by 3. And leave all these the same. Make sure pri to prioritize quality over speed is checked. And make sure your video quality is all the way up to high. Advanced video leave, audio leave, system leave, project, video rendering quality. Make sure that's always set to best and then you just save it as your camera then you render it so I'm going to render testing and look how fast this actually renders and you will actually get the best quality capable out of your camera and if you do not record in HD do not render in HD I cannot stress this enough because it just stretches out the image and it just makes it worse and it makes the file size actually bigger so look how fast that renders for MPEG 2 and this will actually get you the best quality so thank you guys very much for watching this video tutorial and I'll see you guys in the next one thank you and have a nice day